eyes. He tried, but death was his fate. And dying by your hand was a far kinder fate than by epochs. Hmm. So no, hmm. I do not mourn him. I mourn the brothers I never had. You're my new Wayfinder. I am? And you're the one we fought through an army of cryptus to save? I am. Iskarin. Very informal for someone who's never met me. Sorry. I've heard so much about you. I don't care what you call me. Iskarin is comfortable. He is comfortable. But I've been called many names. And all of them are as true as this one. I've lived many lives. And I haven't always looked like this. You've always been a mystery to me. You first caught my eye in your pursuit of Zaitan. I started to piece it together. You've been watching. Why didn't you help? It's not my job to interfere with nature. The path unfurled as expected. You're alive. Most of your friends are alive. Most of them? Oh, calm. Life is death, and things could have been far worse, I promise. I do want to thank you, Wayfinder. Your aid was clearly needed here. And will be needed as you march with your friend. Welcome back to the Canthel Report. This is me, Ray, reporting from our studio in UK Ning. This reporter was recently given the impromptu opportunity to interview the famed Pack Commander during my first world tour. Their eyes, glossy as the Jade Sea, watched me with weariness. The catastrophe in Canthel was still heavy on their soul. We stood in their home, a residential district in Divinity's Reach, the smells of urine and fresh bread competed for attention. I asked their part in ending the dragon cycle. Hiding behind their famed veil of charm, they credited their allies. When I asked of their leadership, they maintained diplomacy, saying they always act on the best information at their disposal. We pivoted to the end of the dragon cycle, which generations suffered. They blamed the dragon void, the force that felled Suwon. I asked what's next for the commander. With exhausted eyes, they shook their head like a child, frightened and uncertain. Near the end of our interview, the commander was pulled away in a frenzy of emotion. A letter fell into their lap as we spoke. They peeled it open with the precision of a hardened warrior, delicate but intentional. Their eyes glanced over the contents, dread, but possibly a hint of warmth, brushed their cheeks before they looked to me. Sorry was all they could mumble before leaving. While I wasn't able to ascertain their call to action, I can only assume they were pulled to the arms of another battle. Next up on the Tampa Report, I go head to head with Ritlock Brimstone, ally of the Commander and Tribune, of the Blood Legion. <laughs> Ritlock, how do you feel about the escalating calls for global unity following the death of Su Wan? 
Get that damn thing out of my face before I shove it! Until next time, stay sharp, Kyria. Hey, Commander. Can I borrow your comms device? Of course. I haven't worked on one of these things in years. What is this? Oh, did she have voice messages? Oh, time, eh? Do you need any help working that? Commander! What the heck? Where have you been? I've been trying to reach you for weeks. I hope whatever cave you've been hiding in at least... Hi, Timey. Timey? Soja? Is that you? Yeah, it's me. Hey, Commander. Could you give us a moment? Take as long as you need. I... Okay. Yeah, I know. Sit still, and this will go faster. If Arena were here, you know what she'd say. <sighs> Don't look at me. She already pinned me down to siphon away my blood for testing. I am simply making sure that you are both at optimum health. Don't let me interrupt. Please interrupt. Not at all. You're next. I'm sure the Wayfinder has places to be. Ah, uh, behave. You're supposed to be a leader, Warden. We've a moment to celebrate. Even you deserve to breathe a little for keeping us all in one piece. Though, I could use a salve or two. That last battle reminded me that I am indeed no longer a student of the colleges. Oh, I have something. Rest, Wayfinder. I'm sure this calm is only temporary. When the sun rises, it'll be another day. It's only a matter of time before we need to tell the rest of the world what happened here. So, kick your boots off. I suppose we're going to have to tell them, one way or another, in case it happens again. For now, let yourself refuel. When I was a shaman... Go, quickly, or he'll bore you to death with a monologue about the time he drank soured ale and saw Nut's face on every... Uh, it... It's a good story. Who am I to distract from the doctor's orders, anyway? Narcisse, have at him. Wayfinder! Oh, come, come! Glade speaks for us both, and it's especially good to see you. Oh, when Skrit woke up, the sky was red, and Crip just were... Well, Urchik should have known that the commander would prevail. You know, you really can drop the commander now, Urchik. Skrit will always honor the commander's legacy, even if they've begun a new one, or are about to begin another. I guess I can't leave my past behind, but that's a much more complicated conversation. It was an honor, fighting with you both. The honor was, and is, <laughs> ours. So, any lingering reservations about our new friend here, Dagda? Last-minute notes? Hmm. That twinkle in your eye. 
For what starless purpose would you ask such a question? Oh, just stoking the forge. As always, you're so above it all. Good of you to notice. I am grateful you gave me a chance to... adjust. Much has changed, and quickly. It can be jarring for the eldest of us. My history with immortal entities has been... mixed. Here's hoping this whole Wayfinder thing is a good change. If the heroes of this age are even half your measure, the court may even call on others in time. It may be inevitable. Dagda! I owe it to Mabon to try. We're going somewhere cold after this, and on flat Earth. <laughs> Not warm? We could rent that little bungalow near the blood tide coast. <laughs> Don't you two look rested? No, unfortunately. But we've got them on the back foot. I'm more worried for the mainland than Omnitas now. Cryptus are still coming in from Nios, but their numbers are weaker. Eparch is scared. Poor thing. We don't want to assume, but things are looking up. I'm just glad you're taking a moment for yourselves. Savor it. Oh, we will. Planning our first vacation in... what, seven years? At least. The Ward has very strict rules for interacting with the rest of the world. But we could use a few days away. Okay, so now we got the story of what's going on. I know, very long story, but it gives you a good idea of what is going on in this world, so, um, go up, hit through the portal, and poof, this mission's been completed, uh, got that, got that, ooh, wait, I think we needed that one, um, okay, let's see, yep, got the whole collection. Got the Sky Rift Hunter's outfit. So, okay, just need to go through the portal. And let's go ahead and. Yeah, that's the one we needed. Uh, we should have it. Let's go for the heavy armor, because that's what I wear. Okay, got the skin. So, got the skin now. Oof. Looks like I gotta do some inventory cleanup. Um. Ah, there it is. Which is an achievement. So let's go ahead, let's mount that up, and we'll do some color changing. Kind of get it looking better. Um, but let's put that on. Where is it? There it is. Poof. We are now in the full Rift Hunters outfit. So, I just don't like this color scheme. We gotta change this color scheme up. Um, let's go through and let's do a little bit of color scheme changing.
Okay, that's not good. Um, you know what? I got an outfit thing for this. Okay, we're chapter 11. Should be, yeah, should be like maybe one more, not, um, then it's prologue. Um, I don't know, I might change up my mastery. I got enough to cap that one. I don't know, I'll have to decide which one to do. Uh, I might even go for that one. Uh, I had to decide off the game what I'm going to do for that one. Um, but that looks pretty good. That one looks good. Um, Cause that one will have me done a lot more chest. So, but anyways, I'll figure it out off camera. Let's get going here and all right, let's start the quest line and see what's going on. Wayfinder. Frode, how's the astral ward? Recovering. Still got the odd cryptus or two coming in from Nios. Nothing we can solve with a hammer to the skull. That's good to hear. These past few months, I've been recovering in my own way. It's still a shock, knowing what I do. Uh, Isgarin and Paitha are waiting for you. Follow me. They're... getting along, at least. Oh? Consider me curious. And anxious. Alright, let's follow you. Huh? There they are. Let's see what they all gotta say. They're here. Good. Her presence is not kind to one's sense of inner calm. Darling of you, Garen. So, this is what you meant by getting along. Paitha informs us that the situation in Nios is escalating. I didn't intend to join that fight, but better to stop a growing threat than ignore it. I cannot spare the ward yet, but we should take action. We've been seeing a spike in rift attacks here, too. 